Juan, which we can hear me good. <coughs> yeah, man, you're good. Got you. Testing, testing, one, two, three, microphone testing. Tell me when I'm ready. Ah, you're good. Anytime. Count it down to ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Thanks for tuning in. One more Monday night, 8 o'clock, primal, 4 p.m. And this evening, I'm going to beg your indulgence. It's not like you're not indulging when you're listening to me or watching me. But I'm going to just beg for your indulgence again. Two years tomorrow, my eldest brother. A brother, a father, a friend, a cousin, a whole If there was ever a Renaissance man, he would have been self God from the full spectrum of life experience. Now you go plumbing, now you go electrical, car mechanic, and himself a company. He was one of the first professional photographers outside of the island. He was an apprentice to Mr. Chin from the board and the landscape. Through construction, hotel management. The first man they never see your class to class where come back to style. Well, that has gone out of style, but class was very popular. It was the first time we see your desert. Go to the press, they are themselves well in public. But ironically enough, the man writing Tyler, quite a few curse words, right? Who is my beat as I put him to look out for? See that tough thing about it is to look down and tell them I know what's cool enough to be my father. But by the time I know we have a friend John, I used to move with enough, enough movement in school, but I used to do it. Cricket match, football match, I was a man. I was a man. Association of Family, President of Great Association, President of Jericho, all around community man, councillor, just and peace, all around. So when I say a Renaissance man, that I want a man who understood the world, understood the community, understood the community. But why this is not really a tribute, I just want to take a moment to kind of just reflect, you know? And the reason why I use the opportunity to reflect. Is that if we're not careful with this internet thing and the way information is passed around, we lose sight of some of the basic fundamental human characteristics that we have, you know. Kindness, sharing, love, forgiving. Stay away from the sus one, the gossip, the bad behavior. Because if you're not careful, man, you get to move away with all the garbage that floats around. And it takes us away from some of the things that meaningful things in our lives, family, friends, and community. So while we don't necessarily have to be nation builders, we don't have to be erudite, everybody doesn't have to be an exemplary. But even within your local corner, yeah man, even with your local friends, even with your youths, your mother, your father, your sister, your brother, your uncle, your cousin, your community. If you just try to be a decent human, you'd be surprised to know how the darkness fall, you know, and the impact you have on other people's lives. Because as much as we think the world is a big world, and we don't want to do something, so much. If you remember that sometimes you just get to tell when, when circumstances that you like just come full circle. So if you look how that man leading life, I remember knowing that I was about to see him. 
still very well with a terrible number in our community who are liberalized. For the matter, you give back to community. Many of us, and so we start that year that the man will be and still told when the man was alive. But as we have here, we have a care for community, we have a care for people in general. But let's say, could that be taken from that for us to understand? And pardon me, you know, pardon me. There are actually the philosophies in life. We have some guests planned for the local and the continent safety. But the reason why I reason about how we are as people from rural Jamaica, we can hold on to some of the things, some of the negative energy in our community. We drive the internet and drive argument and drive sus and drive talk. And we can remember that at the end of the day, the things that are revealed to me is supposed the lives of the people of us. As again, I say, we don't have to be all nation builders. We don't have to be all Indian chiefs and head cooks. But within the framework of how we live our lives, we have to be reminded that decency overshadows all. Kindness, love, sharing overshadows all. And when we hang on to some of the things that we see, exhibited in our community. Not only necessarily our local community, but our world community. And we see all the good things that we show we see show up on the internet about the things that are happening and the rumors and the gossip and the innuendo. And you said to yourself, how will that in five years impact the lives of the people around you? And the reason why I say this as well is is that I take note, I take key note as far as the things I mean, for example, um, chat, WhatsApp, and Facebook, and Instagram. When there is a meaningful issue to be addressed, everybody stays up. When there's a positive issue to be dealt with, when somebody's in need, everybody stays up. But let it be a little passive, let it be a little negative energy. Not everybody, I guess. This is human nature, yeah? But we are, but we are cognizant of that. We understand that. So why still the magnet of bad data pulls us in so strongly? So with that, my experience has started. And this is a growth. This is an era of growth that I have embraced, that many of us are embracing. Is that while we engage in talk about how we want to make, how we want to impact change, not necessarily in our own personal space, but in community and family and so on. We must be mindful of the fact that at the end of the day, it's how that positive energy that you transfer is going to be much more meaningful than the negative energy that you attach yourself to on a daily basis. You have to give information. Are you going to be overwhelmed? Gonna be so saturated with negative energy that you're not gonna understand how to turn around. You're not gonna understand what it means when you see something coming at you that is really good and positive. So you see that little car park in the background. That car park was the foundation, was the foundation, was the field. And there was I always refer to the evidence of my brother to referee matches. I remember no, no, no decision made by any referee anywhere in the world. Remember, no, you're going to split 50 50 guys to besides the other thing. So you can never make the right decision. Very, very rare split to besides come together and say, Yes, good God, very rare. But I saw many, many, many a community spirit rich and full where the sports day, the teach field, or Carter Park. Saka match, Halifax, Saabon, Yoke. Yeah. That the place in the park where there was a foundation for many of us. So why then can't we embrace some of those positive energies that come out of our smartphone? 
urban model as I always, always reminded us. But while we, this era is what we know, this era of Portland, 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 Jamaica, that's what we know. There are many small communities in the world that we have some active events. Specifically, I can always constantly. Feel fulfilled and my life's journey that effort to try and give back to community. One of many people, one of the is again. And as I said, this is not a tribute, so to speak, because we call it whenever we will really do it. Tribute and give time and exchange. Something meaningful, much more meaningful. But once again, we'll try to do your Thank you for allowing me to indulge in the selfish. But remember, sometimes this is a life. Sometimes life just throws some curveballs at you. I have a chance. The roller coaster, the roller coaster car life. But constantly remind me that it is a fact. Starts with giving myself, myself, the best sleep. Right? Accept that we really understand it, that there's some reciprocity. Just keep because it's a right to As I always say, one more.